Hello guys! In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can fold the base of Microweb Scorpion designed by Peter Stutchley. There are no diagrams for this model, only the crisp pattern. In order to fold the model from crisp pattern, first you must progress all the lines. This model is box splitted. That means that it's based on some grid. In this case, it's based on 36 by 36 grid. In order to divide the paper in 36 by 36 grid, you must first divide it into 9 equal parts. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to do that. Before folding, you must make sure that you have enough big paper. In this short video, I'm using a small piece of gummy paper, but later on, I'm using 35 by 35 centimeters of craft paper. Before making the grid, make sure that you start with color side up. And when you divide the paper in 18 parts, then you're going to turn around the paper and make 36 grid there. Now that you know how to make 9x9 nine nine grid on colored setup, repeat that once again, so now we get 18x18 18 18 grid. Now you're going to turn around the paper and repeat that process again. 
This will make us 36 by 36 grid. Now why turning around the paper? That's because the first crease of the crease pattern will be mountain fold and this will help us later while collapsing the crease pattern. Now in this video I'm going to show you how to collapse the base and this is going to be the last video of this tutorial. Sorry, I forgot to mention this. Before watching the base video, first you must pre-crease diagonal lines of the crease pattern. So now you have the grid and you must add those lines. Now, all those lines should be mountain folded and you must fold them on color setup.
Now that you know how to fold the base, you must shape the mold. This could sometimes be the hardest part of the mold. Fairly easy, since the designer took really nice pictures of this mold, which you can find in the link in the video description. So try to shape the mold according to those pictures. If you have problems shaping, I might be able to make the shaping tutorial, but that won't be really tomorrow, but soon. Thank you so much for watching this video. Now if you can, please subscribe to my channel and like this video. And if you want to request a video or video tutorial, please send me the email on origamisage at gmail.com which you can also find in the link in the video description or just send me the private message. See you next time.